Hello everyone, I am Soumya. Welcome to KSN Pharma Tutorials. Today we are going to study about sedatives and hypnotics. What is sedatives? Sedatives are the drugs which acts on the CNS and produce calming effect without sleep. Next, hypnotics. These are the drugs which acts on CNS and produce calming effect with natural sleep. The difference between sedatives and hypnotics is produce calming effect without sleep is called as sedatives. Produce calming effect with natural sleep is called as hypnotics. Next, coming to classification, sedatives and hypnotics are classified into four types. First one, barbiturates. Barbiturates are again classified into four types. First one, long-acting barbiturates, intermediate-acting barbiturates, short-acting barbiturates, ultra-short-acting barbiturates. So first one, long-acting barbiturates. Examples, barbitol, phenobarbitol, mephobarbitol. This is the structure of barbitol. The numbering is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Removal of two alkyl groups, other structure is called as barbituric acid. Substitution of diethyl groups, at 10 fifth position is called as barbitol. The nomenclature is 5,5-diethyl barbituric acid. Next, phenobarbitol. Pheno indicates phenyl. Pheno indicates phenyl group that is substituted at an fifth position. The difference between barbitol and phenobarbitol is C2H5 at fifth position in barbitol, C6H5 group at an fifth position in phenobarbitol. Next structure, mephobarbitol. ME indicates methyl. PHO indicates phenyl. Barbitol that is barbituric acid. Methyl group is substituted at an first position in nitrogen. Next, phenyl group is substituted at an fifth position that is called as mephobarbitol. Nomenclature is 5-ethyl, 1-methyl, 5-phenyl barbituric acid. And second one is intermediate acting barbiturates. Example, amobarbitol. Isopentyl side chain is substituted at an fifth position is called as amobarbitol. Butyl side chain is substituted at an fifth position is called as butabarbitol. The nomenclature is 5-ethyl, 5-butane, 2-ile barbituric acid that is called as butabarbitol. And next one, short acting barbiturates. Examples, pentobarbitol. Okay, pentyl side chain is substituted at an fifth position. Pento, okay. Pentane side chain is substituted at an fifth position. Okay, so this side chain is attached to an ring at an second position. At an second, this is one, this is two. Second position that is called as pentobarbitol. Secobarbitol that is allyl side chain is substituted at an fifth position. The difference between pentobarbitol and secobarbitol is C2H5 group is substituted in an pentobarbitol as an R1 group. In secobarbitol, allyl group is substituted at an fifth position as R1 group. R2 group is same. Both are pentane side chains. Okay, now. So, pentane 2 aisle. Pentane 2 aisle side chain is substituted at 10 fifth positions. Okay. Next, ultra short acting barbiturates. Examples, thiopentol, thiaminol. The structure of thiopentol is thio indicates sulfur. Penta indicates pentyl side chain. Okay. So, thia group is substituted at 10 second position. And pentyl side chain is substituted at 10 fifth position that is called as thiopentol. So, second category benzodiazepines. Examples diazepam, oxazepam, lorazepam, chlordizepoxide, alprazolam, midazolam, chlorzepate, etc. The structure of diazepam. 
So benzodiazepines means benzene ring which is fused with an 7 membered ring containing an unsaturation. It contains 2 azamoities at an 1 comma 4 position. So it is called as benzodiazepines. Okay. So in diazepam, methyl group is substituted at an first position and phenyl ring is substituted at an fifth position and chlorine group is substituted at an seventh position that is called as diazepam. The ring is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Nomenclature is 7 chloro, 1 methyl, 5 phenyl, 3 H, 1 comma 4, Benzo diazepine 2 own. This is called as diazepam. Next one, oxazepam. The difference between diazepam and oxazepam is hydroxy group is substituted at an third position that is called as oxazepam. Next one, lorazepam. The difference between oxazepam and lorazepam is first position. Oxazepam contains methyl group and lorazepam contains hydrogen. And other difference is this is 2 dash position. 2 dash position contains chlorine group. Okay. So lora means below. So below ring means phenyl ring. In phenyl ring, second position contains chlorine group. This is the difference between oxazepam and chlorazepam. Difference is present. In first position and two dash position. Next, chlorodijepoxide. So, methyl amino group is substituted at an second position and oxide group is present at an fourth nitrogen that is called as chlorodijepoxide. Next, alprazolam. Okay, so the numbering is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 and 11. This is called as triazole moiety, 3 nitrogens and it contains methyl group at an first position. Okay, this is called as triazolo 1 comma 4 benzodiazepines. Alprazolam is comes under triazolo 1 comma 4 benzodiazepine category. And next structure is chlorzepate. The difference between oxazepam and chlorzepate is first position contains methyl group in oxazepam and chlorazepam contains hydrogen. And third position oxazepam contains OH group Chlorzepate contains COOH group. Zep 8. 8 means carboxylic acid. Acid. So COOH group is substituted at a third position that is called as chlorazepate. Next one. Third category non benzodiazepines. Examples Jopiclone, Jolpidem, and Alpidem. This is the structure of Zolpidem. The numbering is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. Okay. It contains an methyl benzene ring at an second position and dimethyl acetamide group at an third position. Okay, this is called as imidazole moiety and this is called as pyridine ring. Okay, so pyridine ring and imidazole moiety and at the same time toluene ring and at the same time dimethyl acetamide group are present in an zolpidum. Okay, so next one, last category miscellaneous. It is again divided into three subclasses. First one. Alcohol and carbamate derivatives. Examples. Carbamate derivatives. Example. Meprobamate. Okay. So, ME indicates methyl. Pro indicates propyl. Bamate indicates carbamate. Okay. So, carbon which is attached with an methyl group and it contains an propyl side chain and and it is attached with an dicarbamate derivatives, dicarbamate groups. Okay. So, this is 1, 2, 3. This is an propane. Okay. Propane side chain. It contains two alls. So, it is called as propane diol. And it is attached with an two carbamate groups. That is 
dicarbamate and it contains one methyl group and one propyl group that is called as meprobamate and next one ethchlorvinol it indicates ethyl group chlor indicates chlor vinol so ante vinyl group containing an alcoholic group so the numbering is 1 2 3 4 5 okay so 1 chloro 3 ethyl okay 1 pentene double bond in between 1 and 2 so 1 pentene 4 Ile, okay, 3 all. This is called as ethchlorvinol. So, next, second second one, amides and imides. Examples, glutethimide. It contains an piperidine moiety and it is attached with an 1-phenyl ring and an C2H5 group. Okay, so it contains two dione moieties at an 2,5 positions. It is called as glutethimide. And last one, aldehydes and their derivatives. Example, paraldehyde, triclophos sodium. This is the structure of paraldehyde. Okay, it contains trimethyl groups and three oxone groups. Okay, so the numbering is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay, 2, 4, 6 trimethyl, 1, 3, 5, trioxane that is called as paraldehyde and next one triclophos sodium okay it contains ethyl group and second carbon is attached with an 3 chlorine moieties and first carbon is attached with an hydrogen phosphate that is called as triclophos sodium thank you